Spiders from the Tetragnatidae family have extremely long legs, two rows of four eyes each, and their abdomen is elongated. This one is the male. A bit smaller, its pedipalps have been modified to carry the male generative fluid or sperm. Their long and pointed glissary are a danger for both individuals. Thus, part of the ritual is to fasten each other's glissary to make it impossible to attack each other while carrying out the fecundation process. male inserts its pedipalps in the female's abdomen and deposits the sperm. When the male is done, it disengages its glissary and scares away to avoid being eaten by its mate. The female spins its nest in the backside of a leaf. It can alter the types of silk threads to make them more soft and fluffy to create a barrier with air that acts as an insulator. But, at the same time, allows the presence of oxygen so the eggs can develop. The silk also serves as a cushion that protects the eggs from the movements caused by the wind. These arachnids are frequently found on the vegetation near streams all around the world. Although spiders are the most important predators in many habitats, they too can be hunted by other organisms like this killer bug. These stretched leg spiders abound near streams, and one of their preys is the damselfly, who is also a predator. 
they have binocular vision that allows them to catch little flying insects like gnats. Although they seem too big to be captured by the spiders, the arachnids have oversized chelicerae that can break the damselfly's exoskeleton. <laughs> 